Cardiovascular disease is one of the leading causes of death in the world and every year thousands of people worldwide are diagnosed with high blood pressure, high levels of bad cholesterol and risk of blood clots. Various medications such as satins, blood pressure medications, and disaggregants are often used to treat these conditions. However, there are also natural ways to improve cardiovascular health, including the use of garlic. Let's break down the question of whether garlic can be helpful in this situation and see what one of the latest research says. Don't forget to like, subscribe and hit the bell button to get notifications of new videos. Experiments on animals have shown that garlic can reduce the level of bad cholesterol, which is the main cause of atherosclerotic plaque formation, which in turn can lead to serious consequences. Given that garlic is affordable and relatively safe, it can be seen as a possible alternative to pharmaceuticals for the prevention and treatment of cardiovascular disease. This is because it can reduce triglycerides, which are other blood lipids and contribute to plaque formation and serious cardiovascular complications. In addition, garlic can improve the function of the endothelium, which is the inner lining of blood vessels, with the endothelium producing nitric oxide. Garlic has also been shown to be effective as a disaggregant for platelets, reducing their ability to adhere and activate, and thus acting as an alternative to aspirin. These properties of garlic are mainly due to the two main substances that contain large amounts of sulfur. These are aline and glutamine cysteine. Aline contains 1.8% of the weight of raw garlic. It is odorless on its own and has no irritant properties whatsoever. However, when one cuts or remembers a garlic clove, an enzyme called allinase immediately kicks in and converts all I in to allicin. Allicin is a substance we all know well, we can smell it and we can taste it. Garlic has many forms of use, from raw garlic to garlic oil. Raw garlic can be consumed whole or cut into pieces, or it can be ground into a powder or turned into an aqueous or alcoholic extract. All of these forms have sulfur-containing components in them, which are the main active ingredients in garlic. Allicin, a substance that has many beneficial properties, including fighting harmful bacteria, is also available in capsules. The average garlic clove weighs between 5 and 10 grams, and the powder derived from that clove takes about one-eighth of a teaspoon. One clove and the powder contain about 180 milligrams of aline, or allicin if fermented. Garlic can be consumed in various forms depending on the needs and preferences of the user. But they all contain sulfur-containing components, which are the key active ingredients. The cysteine glutamine found in garlic also has a significant impact on heart health. It has the ability to lower blood pressure. In addition, the glutamine cysteine in garlic has anticoagulant properties, meaning it helps thin the blood and prevent blood clots. This can be helpful in preventing heart attacks and strokes associated with blood clots. For 22 years, studies have been conducted using various types of garlic, including raw garlic, garlic alcohol extract, garlic oil, garlic powder and other forms. In most studies, the dose of garlic was about 10 grams per day. As a result, they have shown that garlic use can marginally improve blood lipid profiles. Specifically, Garlic use reduced bad cholesterol levels by an average of 10% and slightly reduced triglyceride levels. A slight increase in high-density lipoprotein levels has also been noted. However, not all studies have confirmed these results, and some have found no effect of garlic consumption on heart and vascular health. Regarding the use of garlic as an alternative to current cardiology medications, Keep in mind that garlic cannot replace medications that lower low-density lipoprotein levels. To get more detailed information check the full article on our website link you can find in the description. However, garlic can be used as a supplement to diet and other measures that aim to lower cholesterol. It is important to note that no side effects have been reported from the use of garlic in studies, with the exception of some cases of allergic reactions. Therefore, if you are considering using garlic to improve cardiovascular health, you can include it in your diet in moderate amounts, while taking your individual body characteristics into account. In general, 
Using garlic as part of a comprehensive approach can be helpful for lowering cholesterol and hypothetically for reducing the likelihood of complications from cardiovascular disease.